Lehigh police are investigating a possible murder-suicide with two victims. They found a man and a woman shot in a Jeep late last night. 11 News reporter Steve Jones went to Lehigh to inv investigate. Steve, what a shocking event. Oh, you know, it really was, and it's saddening for the whole community. This morning, it was quiet and somber there, a stark contrast to the horror that happened last night. The two victim shooting caught the community completely off guard. This is a pretty, pretty peaceful area, you know, a lot of young families, a lot of kids, and you just don't expect something like this to happen, of course, in your own neighborhood. You know, it's, it's uh, kind of one of those surreal things. That Neighbors called the police last night after they heard gunshots. Police say they arrived on the scene to find Sarah Davis and Stephen Brad Davis shot in their Jeep, which was parked here. They each had gunshot wounds to their heads, and Sarah Davis was dead. Police say they think Brad Davis was the shooter. Evidence suggests that he fired a shot at uh, Sarah Davis and then turned the gun on himself. Police say that Brad Davis survived the shot and that he's currently in critical condition at a local hospital. Police found a 9mm handgun registered to Brad Davis between the two victims. Police say the couple was estranged from each other and that Brad Davis was living at his family's home where the shooting happened. The couple's two kids were in the house at the time of the shooting, as was the rest of Davis's family. Uh, you know, our hearts definitely go out to them and, and wish them the best in their family, and, and hopefully they can uh, get past this as, as soon as possible. There were some initial reports that perhaps the wife had shot the husband in this case, but police are sticking with the idea that he was the shooter. Okay, thanks, Stephen.